Well, this morning, more than 50 people raised their right hand, took an oath, and became U.S. citizens. It was extra special because the all-women ceremony was in honor of Women's History Month. And as ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell found out, it was a very big and emotional event. Take a look around this room, and you'll see a group of women embodying the American dream. People like Veronica Kuznetsova. I actually didn't expect that I was going to be so excited. Kuznetsova is from Russia, and Friday morning, she became a U.S. citizen. It gives me more stability, I guess, protection uh, opportunities, of course. In celebration of Women's History Month, U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services and the U.S. District Court of the Middle District of Florida held an all-women naturalization ceremony. The United States has always been and always will will be a land of opportunity. Speakers recognize the distances traveled and obstacles overcome. The 54 citizenship candidates came from 30 countries, like Moran Zaltzman from Israel. I love this country. And Sheena Medina from the Philippines. It was a long process, but it was all worth it. The ceremony, which included the oath of allegiance, was the final step to citizenship. I hereby declare on oath their voices loud and proud. And all 54 of these individuals who just took the oath of allegiance are now United States citizens. Never ever in my life I thought that I would be here and I would live another life in a completely different country. Kuznetsova now focusing on her next big goal, opening her own coffee shop, now realizing her American dream. Just follow your dream and don't be afraid of anything. In Hillsborough County, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.